Good morning. Pleased to be here. Um, Claudio Gimidi, I lead the innovation for Club Coffee in Toronto. We're a large coffee roaster, a uh, large Canadian coffee roaster with distribution all over North America. And we're really excited about where we are in terms of taking a leadership role, we think globally, uh, with our new compostable coffee pod that we've developed here in Canada, uh, in terms of a, a leadership role, in terms of waste reduction, and uh, really addressing uh, an issue that's emerged over the last two or three years because the coffee category has literally transformed that quickly in the last few years here in North America and Europe for that matter. So as a great Canadian legend once said, I, I skate to where the puck's going to be, not to where it's been. And we've had our eye on, um, on the issue of coffee um, and sustainability and uh, what's been going on with uh, single serve coffee for the last few years. Uh, this, this particular comic, although it's funny, it's, it's, you know, it, it demonstrates actually two things, that coffee, single serve coffee has been demonized in the last uh, couple of years because people are seeing the, um, the landfill impact. But at the same time, uh, we've conducted an LCA study that shows that single serve actually helps reduce food waste. And so um, there's a contradiction there that people are having to deal with. They love the convenience. Uh, the food waste uh, angle probably isn't that well known yet to consumers. People see uh, a lot of waste and they're wanting to do something about that and that's what we've been <coughs> focused on. This curve just shows you how quickly the uh, category has transformed in the last three or four years. Uh, that big red bar there shows you how now single serve coffee is the number one selling coffee in, in, the, in the marketplace in Canada and has well overtaken uh, traditional roasting ground coffee very quickly, basically in three years. And those wonderful brewers that, uh, that Keurig sells us have become the number one household appliance. And so uh, the combination of those two say that this is one, a very uh, uh, dominant and quickly moving uh, trend. And it's only going to continue to grow because as coffee and tea have exploded onto the market, there are now soups, um, uh, cereals, and a whole, whole host of other products that uh, the world is contemplating putting in single serve packaging. And we've come up with a solution that we think helps address the issue, which is not biodegradable and it's not recyclable, but it's compostable. And I don't believe that this solution is a solution for all, all uh, issues of this nature. Uh, what Single Serve represents is very intimate contact of packaging and organic food material, which are not very easy for people to disassemble or take apart at end of life. And although there, are, uh, there is belief that recyclability could be a solution to this, uh, the category is driven by convenience. And we believe that whatever solution you're going to provide in something like this needs to be a convenient and intuitive solution. So we really think compostable is the way to go. Uh, we've we used, we used and espoused uh, the, uh, the principles of a circular economy. 90% uh, of the pod is actually bio-based. We've used new technology coming out of the University of Guelph that allows us to put uh, uh, a byproduct of our roasting process, a coffee chaff, into the product. And, uh, and so we're actually recycling uh, part of our, our uh, waste back into the product. And uh, we are now making many of the materials that were traditionally bought uh, abroad right in our own province. And there's the, uh, the, old, the food waste uh, uh, reduction as well. The, the, the issue of, of uh, the large uh, owners of, of the category, the leaders in the, in the industry, and being stuck in recyclability uh, is not one that we're going to address quickly. But I'll say this in terms of the issue. Uh, recycling of, of, uh, in a situation like this provides a solution, but it only addresses 10% of what uh, is, is uh, the waste at the end of life of these products. In other words, if you can, if you can recycle the cup that's, that's, been, uh, that, that's there, that takes care of 10%, but the rest of it is actually going, uh, still going into landfill. So that's why I believe, we believe compostability is the right solution. So for these reasons, we've gone and certified and developed uh, a very simple and yet intuitive uh, solution to uh, single serve. Uh, you know, I've, I've covered most of these points. We've, we do have certification. We're the first certified product in the world for coffee, tea, and other hot beverages, and we can't wait to get it into the marketplace, into consumers' hands, so that, that they can start to enjoy guilt-free coffee, because I think they, they are struggling with the, the concept of single serve relative to um, uh, what they feel. And this is really just a, a comment to say, this sort of thing is only uh, 
possible with uh, vi a great vision, a lot of innovation, and, and, and working collaboratively with people that, like you around this, this room today and, and our, my colleagues here. And, um, you know, if, if we get collaboration between academia, industry, and, uh, and, and government, I think we'll get to solutions like this much more quickly. Thank you.